Hey guys, I'm Jake. You're watching the Prepper's Bunker Outdoors. I'm here with Benjamin, my littlest ripper. I'm here to talk to you about some uh, bicycles, actually. Bicycles? Yep. You may remember that I did that a video. I got a bicycle too. He's got a bicycle too. A Colony 14 inch BMX. It's a really cool bicycle. And, and I got a helmet. He does have a helmet. You guys may remember I did a comparison between the SE OM Duro and the Thruster Retrograde. The Thruster Retrograde was $650, $650 I believe. The OM Duro, I think, was between $1,000 and $1,300. And the reason that I'm doing this as a prepping channel is this year's... And I got a little brother, Izzy. He does have a little brother, Izzy. This year's theme for fitness is rechilding, right? You went out, you rode BMX bikes, you make memes about it now, you rode all over town, but as soon as you got a car, you never rode again. Now you're a little bit older, you're into prepping, and your body doesn't work so well, right? Uh, your body don't work so well. That's right. Buying a bunch of. Gotta fix it. That's what we're talking about today. I, I guess you gotta uh, cut it and cut your head. No, we don't got to do those. <laughs> so, uh, buying supplements, uh, getting motivational videos, these types of things, they can help you get into shape for a little while, but for long-term physical fitness, you've got to find something that you enjoy. And I'm going to encourage you to look back to when you were younger. So if you're, we're doing this series for if you're trying to get your first bicycle as an adult since you were a kid and you're on a budget, the bike that we went with is this Crew 27 and a half inch BMX here. And we're going to be reviewing this bike and giving it away. It was Patreon funded. Guys, if you like this kind of content, please check out my Patreon and consider becoming a part of it. But what we're talking about today is the SC and the Thruster. I heard a lot of terrible reviews on the Thruster. Is that your favorite tool? Daddy bought this tool for his BMX bike, BMX bike from Park Park Tools in high school. And look, it's shaped like a gun. It is kind of shaped like a gun, isn't it? Uh -huh. I carried that thing for well over a decade. So, at six hundred and fifty dollars on the thruster, I heard a lot of bad reviews and stuff like that. But at six hundred and fifty dollars, it seemed like it was worth it. They've dried up at six hundred and fifty bucks. Now they're over a thousand dollars, and SE has released the killer quad at just over a thousand dollars so at this point the uh thruster retrograde th thruster is a retro inspired brand made by kent bicycles the walmart brand um at this point a thousand dollars for an se versus a thousand dollars for the thruster we'll say 1100 shipped not looking so good for the thruster so this is a recap on that video uh, the thruster has unsealed bearings front and rear lower and spec again. parts lower spec shifter um the om duro is still more expensive and kind of looks lower spec itself than the killer quad this is the first year for the killer quad and it seems like se does a higher spec bike for the first year or two on paint and everything and then they kind of tend to downgrade it seems downgrade it seems especially with the om duro but at 33 pounds for the killer quad with the parts that it's got, it looks really sick. Sealed bearing in the rear, sealed cassette, unsealed in the front. Yeah. You've got to understand if you get serious about this sport that these are still lower grade bikes. Even with the SEs, you do need to expect if you're going to ride it a lot and ride it hard, you're going to upgrade it. You're going to put some money into it to make it a little bit better. Um... And However, make sure to clean your mess. Make sure to clean your mess. At the $1,000 entry point, getting gears, I think it's a good place to get into it, and you can upgrade as you break things. So this video is just basically an update to that little comparison video. Again, at the price, if they're the same price, get the SE. But, guys, don't get the SE if you want, necessarily get it if you want a mountain bike. Okay? Dad, it could be mountain bikeable. Why did you buy this? But it's a bigger, it's a bigger BMX bike that has gears. We're gonna be testing this on the trails, this crew, and a bunch of other stuff. So if you enjoy that kind of stuff, subscribe. If you're prepper looking to and get into shape or rechild, it's gonna be good. 
Make like, sure that you find like, bugs. Like millipedes. Like millipedes. Make sure in the description box below, not only will I have ways that you can support this channel, but I also have this yeah. month's sponsor, which yeah, is Warrior's I, I, Collection. I don't have my huh? Don't never touch, don't never touch, touch wolf spiders. Don't ever touch wolf spiders. Actually, that's not a good rule. I think generally we're not going to touch wolf spiders, but we'll actually probably see if we can't catch and hold some wolf spiders this summer. It's going to be cool. Mama's not going to like it. Thanks for watching. Let me know what you think in the comment section below, and I hope that you have a blessed day. And make sure you, your kids find millipedes. That.